asking questions about Martin Luther King's birthday. WRC TV was asking questions about Martin Luther King's birthday and the progress blacks have made in society. There, CBS sports commentator Jimmy the Greek Snyder gave his impressions of blacks and coaching in the National Football League. His answers could raise as much controversy as the statements by former Dodgers executive Al Campanis last April on ABC's Nightline news program. Yeah, pretty soon they're going to have to equalize it for the blacks, for the Greeks, the Jews, and for everybody. I mean, let's make it equal for everybody. You know. And uh, is it equal? Or what about in sports? Well, they've got everything. If, if they take over coaching like everybody wants them to, there's not going to be anything left for the white people. I mean, all the players are black. I mean, the only thing that the whites control is the coaching jobs. Now, I'm not being derogatory about it, but that's all that's left for them. The black talent is beautiful. It's great. It's out there. It's you know, the, the only thing left for the whites is a, a couple coaching jobs. Yeah, maybe we need to get more black coaches. <laughs> oh, it's all right with me. Okay, well, I'm sure that they'll take over that pretty soon, too. WRC was apparently flooded with complaint calls after the Snyder comments were aired. Snyder issued an apology saying he was truly sorry for anything he said. A uh, CBS spokesperson said no decision has been made as to whether Snyder will work Sunday's NFL Today broadcast. Snyder is spending the night with Gene Upshaw, the Players Union Executive Director in Washington, and he has received support calls from Walter Payton and Ahmad Rashad. Reporter for... Yeah, that's what happens when you speak your mind. You get fired like Jimmy the Greek.